Hi, this is just a supplemental video to go along with my XDK video. Uh, since I recorded it, there have been a lot of changes in the interface, especially around how you create a project. So I'm just going to add in a couple of little notes here around how to start a project uh, just to get you going. So first of all, the biggest thing that's changed is when you first come in, you'll see that you have um, start a new project with templates, samples, and demos, uh, or import your HTML5 code base. To go along with the rest of my tutorial, I suggest you start with templates. Um, and then uh, you can see they actually have some uh, in there now that are like a grid view app, a side view app, a tab view app, um, or you can start with different um, basic game uh, environments. So you can go with Phaser, Pixie, Cocos, 2D Lite, um, all that sort of stuff. Sorry, cat in the way. There we go. And um, so uh, what I'm going to do is just to get you moving along, we'll start with blank. We'll do HTML5 and Cordova. Um, and the important thing down here to keep going along with my other tutorial is to use the use app designer. You'll have to check that box in order to get it to where the other one uh, was. Uh, once you've done that, you can go down to the bottom right here. So just below me right there and click that continue. Uh, you'll see it put, you choose the project directory. I'm just gonna call it test proj um, and hit create. Once you've done that, after a couple of seconds, it'll give you, uh, I'm not going to go through the tour. You can just go, don't show this again, or keep, keep showing it if you want a tour of XDK. I'm just going to say no thanks for now. This is where you get to select your different um, framework. So if you're going for Bootstrap, for example, you can just click on that. Um, framework 7, Ionic, Ratchet, App Framework. So jQuery mobile, whatever you want to choose. Um, I'm going to go with uh, Bootstrap for now. You hit select. And this gets you basically to where you are um, in my other tutorial. Uh, and I'll provide a link to that. Uh, but you can see here that gives you all of your controls. Like you can add in a header, drop it in. Um, and then once the header is in there, you can do things like add a title to it. Titleicious. All right, good enough, whatever. So yeah, that basically gets you to where you're going. Now, if you already have created a project and played around with it, when you first come into my other tutorial, you'll have something that looks basically like this. In that case, you'll wanna click the start a new project down in the bottom left. Um, and that's where you end up in the same place. Now you have the same blank layout user interface games. Uh, samples and demos, all of those things. So again, if you want to use the app designer now, you do have to check this box down at the bottom. All right, that's about it. I'll provide a link to that to this from my other video, and I'll provide a link to my other video if you want to learn how to make an app in XDK in 15 minutes from here. Thanks.